All right, everyone, for math today, you're gonna to need this sheet from your packet and you're going to cut out the outline and also you'll cut these little lines and it's gonna end up looking like this. Um, and you're just gonna mix up all the numbers and you're just gonna make it in a little puzzle. So, and then your child has to just put um, the numbers in order. So let's see, I know that we start with one when we count. So I'm gonna find, here's number one. One, what comes next? Two, where's my number two? There it is, two. Next comes three, one, two, three. Here's my three. One, two, three, four. There's my four. And then I've got five after five. Where's my five? There it is. All right, and you're just gonna put them in order like this and you'll see, do you guys see this picture that's starting to form? Five, six, there's my six. Seven. Um, so if your child needs a little bit more support with this, um, one thing that you can do is you can do it more like focus just on the picture, putting together the picture. Um, there we go. Or you could just do it like break it apart, like just do one, two, three, four, five, and then just do this part six, seven, eight, nine, um, or just focus on the number order for this one and then focus on the pictures for this one. Cause you can see this one, it's a little bit easier because you'll see like the beach balls together, the sailboats together. Um, the end part of it is a little bit easier to do with pictures. And then this part is a little bit easier to do with actual numbers. So it'll end up looking just a puzzle like that. Um, um, yeah, and if your child needs a little more challenge, just have them do it totally independently. Tell them to put the numbers in order. Um, you also could, um, flip it over and write other numbers on the back and want to do higher numbers if you want to. Um, so yeah, if you have any questions about this, let me know.